Okay, I guess he's. In, oh, there he goes. Oh. <laughs> I didn't think it was working for a second. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this guy. Are you serious, Arthur? <laughs> I never seen him smile that much, bro. <laughs> oh, wow. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right yo 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 schemes and graphics we are back in the building with another red dead redemption 2 mod tutorial for you and today we are going to be installing the red dead trainer i know we've been covering um quite a few trainers but we're going to cover all of the trainers all right this one right here is covered by i james sss shout out to the creator when you get down to this download page always read the full description it has a lot of important information in here as well as the requirements and if you click on the requirements um, this is going to require script hook rdr2 by ab by alexander blade and i will leave a link down in the description to that one all right and after you get done reading this full description what you want to do is head over to files the files tab and you want to select manual download okay whichever one is at the top is usually the current and most updated file so I always start with the main files that's at the top and scroll down and select manual download okay so once you have your um, script hook rdr2 and your red dead trainer downloaded on my left hand side I have two downloads the first download is red dead trainer and the second one is script hook rdr2 on my right hand side I have my Red Dead Redemption 2 game directory opened up. What we want to do from here is go back to our downloads and start installing our requirements which is script hook RDR2. Let's open up that one. Inside that folder is going to be another folder that says bin. Open up that one. And we are going to select these two files right here that I have highlighted. And drag and drop both of those files over here to our Red Dead Redemption 2 game directory. Alright I already have it as you can see. Now let's go back to our downloads. Now let's go into the Red Dead Trainer folder. Open up that one. Inside the Red Dead Trainer folder, we are going to be taking both files that are inside that folder and dragging and dropping those right over to our Red Dead Redemption 2 game directory. Once that has been dropped, we are all good to go. So now we could minimize any windows, but before we do that, Let's cover one thing for the Red Dead Trainer. The Red Dead Trainer comes with a configuration settings file. Okay, um, If you look down into your game directory and open up the Red Trainer configuration file, you will see that you could change the keys or toggle things on and off. All right. So right here in the first section, for example, is the hotkeys. Um, to open up the trainer will be um, 114, which will be, I think, uh, function key F3 that was mentioned on the download page. Um, you can change it to another key if you like as well. Um, they do have a teleport to waypoint key and um, some other things you could change. Like, for example, um, they have uh, never wanted no bounty in God mode. Um, God mode is set to false by default. What I'm going to do is change that to true. All right. And uh, no bounty. Nah. I think we're all getting finished down. I'll change this to true also. So feel free to make any changes in this configuration setting. All right, clear dead eye infinite. All right, that looks good for right now. When you're done making the changes, select file and select save. All right, once that has been saved, we can minimize any windows that we might have open and run the game. All right, once you spawn into the game, what you want to do is press uh, F3 if you're using the keyboard or hold on to R1 r2 and press down on the d-pad and that's going to open up this trainer right here on the left as you can see it says red dead trainer by i james sss <laughs> animations options will be the first one uh then we have player options horse options weapon options teleport options pet options we get it uh let's go ahead and check what's inside here play scenario play animations play emotes 
Ah, this is nice. I like that. Do a little emote. Oh, damn. I've never seen that emote right there, right? <laughs> this is pretty cool emotes right here. <laughs> uh, I could already tell this is going to be a fun trainer right here. It has uh, some fun stuff in here for us to do. Let me back up a little bit. Let's do the point. <laughs> right over there. It was jig. Okay, Arthur. Shoot from hip. Bow, 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 bow. All right, they got about 30 of these and uh, 30 of these emotes. Excuse me. They have 30 of those um, animations. You have also. Uh, let's do the male dance. Okay, I guess he's. In, oh, there he goes. Oh. <laughs> I didn't think it was working for a second. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at this guy. Are you serious, Arthur? <laughs> I never seen him smile that much, bro. <laughs> oh wow. You put on a performance, man. Are you still going? Damn, you ain't tired yet? That's a long dance, yo. So uh they got about 13 of these animations. Um you can select stop playing or stop playing immediately. Let's go ahead and select stop playing. And uh yep, that stopped them. But just in case um, stop playing doesn't stop the animation immediately, then you can choose stop playing immediately. Uh, let's go back. You have scenarios also. Um, we have play nearest scenario. See what that is. It's probably going to be sitting down. Yep. It looked like the closest scenario to us was sitting down. There you go. Go and take a load off, buddy. Oh, and we're going to sharpen our knife. I guess uh, we're make a shank one of those um, but you do have um, over a thousand one hundred and ninety one scenarios in here all right so uh, yeah this definitely will keep you busy um, you have the options to stop playing stop playing immediately play nearest scenario play scenario from keyboard all right so let's go ahead and stop playing and if we click stop playing, he'll probably will play the scenario all the way through and then he'll finally get up. But if we select stop playing immediately, I think he's going to jump up. Yep, there we go. <laughs> kind of figured that. All right, what else we have in our menu? Player options. We're not going to go through all the categories, but just like at least through the first two. Uh, we got in player options, wanted options. Uh, we could put never wanted, no bounty clear bounty and become wanted um, I have uh, God mode I could put on let's go ahead and put that on health recharge multiplier infinite stamina um, infinite dead eye clear dead eye and infinite cores there we go restore cores if need to be um, overpowers time okay activate overpowers what's that oh that's it right there okay so that's the overpowers right there and we also have a time frame that uh i guess we could have that last and you have uh deactivate horse powers player stats must be active to view super jump ragdoll got all these nice little fun stuff there we go that's super jump right there <laughs> all right so yeah, you got a bunch of fun stuff in here, man, to try out. Um, horse options. Let me go jump on my horse. Uh, see what we got for this. Let's go, boy. Here for my horse god mode. Infinite stamina. Infinite cores. Uh, fortified. Activate fortified. There we go. Alright, now it's got super jump with the horse. We can jump with the horse. Oh, that's interesting right there. No ragdoll. Run and sprint. Fetch horse, travel to horse, set to male, set to female, clean horse, and auto clean horse. Uh, you also got a horse scale. So we can make our horse bigger. Look at that. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, yeah, we got a beast now. Look at look how big he is, though. Oh, let's make him a little bit bigger. <laughs> oh, man. Arthur looks real small on here, man. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, oops, ride my horse around. <laughs> While I do that, man, we're going to end the tutorial. But if this tutorial helped y'all out to install it, or if you just enjoyed the video, 
feel free to smash that like button for me definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with your friends that are interested in modding red dead redemption 2 yo this game's graphics me and uh, arthur and my big gigantic horse we are out of here until next time <laughs> oh that was a huge jump right there whoa oh oh excuse me pardon me I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.